Hey Jerry, uh, this is Brandon. I'm the guy that talked to you on the phone just a little bit ago about how I can help you uh, get a lot more customers and help you grow your business. So um, just to tell you a little bit about myself real quick, I'm, uh, I'm from Colorado. I live in Surprise, Arizona. I moved down to Arizona back in 2014 because I was a soccer player and I signed with uh, a team out here called Arizona United. So I played with them for a little bit and now I'm kind of retired. Um, I've got a wife and, and little baby girl. And this now is, is what I do for a living. I don't work for a company uh, that, or anything like that. I just work for myself. Um, but what I do is I help small business owners that, that uh, kind of don't know any better or, or don't have the help and resources themselves um, to really grow their business and capture the lion's share of the market for people that are looking for their service um, in a specific city. Um, so I'll just kind of get right into it here. Um, so the the thing is, eighty percent of people when they when they need a local service, they go to Google to find it. So four out of five people go to Google. Um, the other twenty percent are the ones going to Craigslist or Facebook or asking their neighbor or their friend who they know, but the majority of people go to Google and they type whatever they're looking for. Okay, so I just want to show you something real quick. Let's say I wanted information about uh, elephants. Okay, so I go to Google and I type elephants. The first page that comes up here is Wikipedia, Wikipedia's page all about elephants. And the reason why is because Google sees Wikipedia as a very trustworthy source. And they've got like 20,000 plus words all about elephants, all kinds of information about different species and uh, the ears, the trunk, the teeth, everything you could ever want to know about elephants, all right? There's tons of information here. So Google's job is to put the most relevant source of information in front of my eyeballs because if I'm, if I'm using a search engine and I go to Google and I type in elephants and I get information back about candles or notebooks or, or something else, I'm not going to use Google anymore. I mean, there's a reason why they're number one, you know. Um, so it's their job to put the most relevant source of information in front of my eyes for what I'm searching for, okay. So the same thing goes for a local, uh, local service. So, for example, say I'm searching for... Um, uh, window tinting in Mesa, window tinting Mesa AZ. All right, I get these three businesses here that pop up in the local maps, and then I get these businesses down below um, in the organic listings here. Okay, now there's a few, there's a lot of different factors. Google's got like 200 different factors that go into their algorithm for determining how something ranks, right? But there's Content is one of those one of those more important things. All right, so if we take a look at your site here You know it it looks all right. It looks kind of cool, but the thing is you just don't have all that much information about Pool cleaning, you know, you just don't have all the different keywords and things that people might search So people are going to search for things like pool cleaning Gilbert AZ or pool service Gilbert or uh, Gilbert pool pump repair or uh, maybe pool contractors, you know what I mean? So my job is to basically build out a website that ranks for all those different keyword terms that people might search for, okay? So um, here's pool cleaning in Gilbert, but let me show you real quick before I get into that, just a quick little example here of a site that I built. So for example, say, um, say you're driving your car through Scottsdale and you break down and you need a tow truck. All right, most people are gonna whip out their phone, they're gonna go to Google and they're gonna put something like Scottsdale tow truck, okay? That is the most searched term, okay? And if you do, you're gonna come across these three listings here in the map, and this one at the top here is mine, Scottsdale tow truck company. And I'm also right here, number one at the top of the organic listings, okay? Now if I click on that site, here's my site, and I've got just tons of information all about towing. I've got the different cities that that we can service. I've got uh, you know auto towing, 
car accident recovery, roadside assistance, fuel delivery, flat tire changing, car lockout, battery jump start. Um, just tons of different information, keywords, content, all about towing. Okay. And uh, in Google's eyes, when somebody's searching for a tow truck in Scottsdale with these words, I am the most authoritative source, and that's why I pop up first, okay? So because of that fact, um, it gets the majority of the phone calls for people to search that. Now, let's say people search something different, like towing service, okay? Someone goes and they type Scottsdale towing service. Now, if you can see here, I'm number three. I'm not at the top of the maps, okay? And if you scroll down, where am I here? I'm like number six there, Scottsdale Tow Truck Company, okay? Now, this site, I went live with it about uh, eight weeks ago, okay? So it took me eight weeks to climb to the top for, for the term Scottsdale Tow Truck, all right? Now, let's say some people might search Scottsdale Towing, and I'm not even in the maps yet. I think I'm right outside. Yeah, I'm right here. I'm number four. So one, two, three. I'm number four there. Okay. Now I'm doing work kind of day in and day out to push that thing up to the top for all these different keywords. I want to be at the top for Scottsdale Towing, Towing Scottsdale, uh, Towing Service Scottsdale AZ, Roadside Assistance, Auto Wrecker, all those things. But at this point, I'm at the top for the most commonly searched term and I'm still close for, for other things like towing service and towing. So it's getting quite a bit of phone calls, right? Now I found this guy, I'll show you here on my website, um, right here. There's a guy named Toby and I found him on Craigslist. Um, and he's just a, an independent guy. He doesn't work for a company. He just owns his own tow truck. And up until, I got in touch with him. He was just advertising on Craigslist um, and, and getting the few people here and there that would go to Craigslist and look for a tow truck and happen to come across his ad out of all the other ads, right? So um, I've been, basically when people call this number, it uh, it forwards to his phone and he uh, he answers it. He goes and gives him he gives him a quote over the phone. And he, if they're happy with it, he goes and he tows their car and he makes money. And we've got a deal worked out where, based on the call volume I'm giving him, uh, he gives me a certain amount back every month. So I'm trying to push this to the point where he's making like ten thousand dollars a month or more, and um, and then I can feel feel right about asking him for uh, a little bit in return. So if we look into pool cleaning and Gilbert, right? I I think this is probably the most common thing that people would search for is pool cleaning, Gilbert AZ, or pool service, right? So you've got these companies here. You've got above all pool care. These are your competitors, right? Um, like here you go. Above all pool care is number one in the maps there, and they're number two here in the organics behind the, the Yelp listing, right? So ideally what I would do for you is I would build out a site to generate leads for, for pool cleaning in Gilbert or Mesa or Chandler or whatever kind of what kind of whatever area you you most want to target. Um, and we'd optimize it to to also pull in for pool service, for pool pump repair, um, for whatever those other little you know pool if it's if you fix leaks and stuff like that. Um, We'd optimize it to, to pull in leads for all those things and, and it would eventually climb to the top. It takes a little bit of time, but man, this is where the majority of the market is. So basically, we're just putting out a huge net right here to catch all the fish that are coming to the top of Google. Because the thing is, people don't go, people do not do not go, I'm going to go down here and I'm going to go to page two. And let me see who's on page two. Uh, okay, now I'm going to go to page three. Okay, let's see. Pool Service Mesa. I want to go with these guys because they're on page three. Nobody's going to do that. Okay. Most people are going to go Pool Cleaning Gilbert AZ and they're going to pick one of these top three that look like they've got good reviews and, and whatever. Or they're going to, a lot of people skip over that and they go straight to these organic listings. It all just depends on the person. But um, right here at the top of Google is where you want to be. It's where all the market is. 
it's where if you're serious about growing your business, you got to make sure that you're there because that's where everybody, that's where all the customers are. So what I do is I get you there and I do the work and see, the thing is all these companies, your company included, you're out there cleaning pools, you're, you're giving estimates, you're doing whatever you do day in and day out for work. You don't have time to, to rank your website, to push, put your time into ranking your website. See, I don't know what, uh, who built your website, you know, maybe it was you guys, maybe you had somebody do it, but if you, if you really want your website to be something that brings you business, it's got to be at the top there. Otherwise it's like a billboard just out in the middle of nowhere. I, when I went through here and just after I talked to you on the phone a minute ago, I, I went to page three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I think I went up to like page 17 and I still didn't find your site azpoolworks.com was was nowhere to be found i mean anywhere so it's it's really pointless like you can send somebody there to to take a look at at this but it's not really gonna it's not bringing you any new customers and so um that's basically what i do i'm really good at it i'm an expert in it really and uh Hopefully this, this video kind of gave you a little insight into, into it and um, I'll, I'll get it emailed over to you real quick and then after you watch it, feel free to give me a call back with any questions you've got or anything like that. But I'd really like to, uh, if you're interested, we can talk about uh, partnering up here and, and really helping you to take over, you know, the thing is we can the sky's the limit really i mean we could do pool cleaning gilbert we could build out pool cleaning mesa pool cleaning scottsdale whatever area you said you service the east valley you know we can we can build out lead generating websites for each of those cities and you can just we can grow your business as big as you want really um it's all about just being in the right spot and having a big enough net to capture all those customers. So um, my number is 970-404-5870. Uh, feel free to give me a call back after you watch this and I'll answer any questions you have and um, anything like that. I live in Surprise, but if you're uh, if you're wanting to meet up in person and stuff, I understand that too. Um, I'd actually prefer that just to make sure that kind of we're a good fit for each other before we even get into something like this. But all right. Uh, thanks, Jerry. Thanks for taking the time and talk to you soon.